Your Game of the Week is sponsored by Embrace Me Organics and Hank's Food Truck, located at the Macon Flea Market. I've said a few times already that Warner Robins Northside is the best robbery in the state. Well, I've seen a lot of high school football in my day and all parts of the state of Georgia, and pure and simply, nothing compares to what happens every year at McConnell Talbert Stadium. Between these two programs, Warner Robins has had Northside's number the last five years, but could the upstart Eagles turn the tide tonight? Here's Shaw Sperani now with our Game of the Week. Hey, Bill, what a night of football we had here at the Mac for our end zone Game of the Week. Yes, the atmosphere, it was electric as always, something we we're expecting anyways, but a close battle between both teams for the first time in a while. You can hear the teams going off behind me, so let's hit the highlights. And here come the demons and all that smoke and the Northside Eagles who are the home team for tonight. And Bill, not a single seat empty tonight. People also skating all outside of the stadium to watch the game. Let's go to the first kickoff as the Demons give it to the Northside Eagles. Return at the 10 yard line, looking to weave around, but a huge hit by the Demons to start the game. First drive for the Demons and quarterback Chase Reese steps back, but he sees trouble and escapes and gets the first down. And it would pay dividends as later in the drive, kicker Daniel Barber knocks it a 44 yard field goal. Beautiful kick as the Demons take the three nothing lead. Not much action for the rest of the first quarter, but to start the second, the Demon long snapper overshoots the punter as the punter goes ahead and kicks it out of the end zone for a safety as the Eagles earn two points, but the Demons are still up three to two. Now Northside with the ball and Damian D quarterback steps away from the trouble and he goes for the end zone, but he's called out of bounds at the two yard line. Then the Eagles go for a field goal two plays later and Ashen Paredes shanks the 12 yard field goal as the Demons still lead three to two. Next drive for the Demons and Reese finds Isaiah Canyon open for the 34 yard play and he's down at the one yard line, what a grab. And then the next play, Reese keeps it himself and QB sneaks it in for the touchdown. Point after is good and the Demons up 10 to two the second half and second drive for the Eagles as D keeps it, gets through the traffic spin move and goes all the way for the 30 yard run as he goes out of bounds at the 20 yard line. And then a few plays later, D steps back and finds the tight end, Brandon Wilson Jr. wide open for the touchdown. Point after good and it's a tie game at 10. Now we go to overtime, Warner Robins with the ball first and the first play, quarterback Reese keeps it and he goes all the way for the touchdown. The point after is good, and Demons go up 17 to 10. Now fourth and eight for the Eagles. Last chance to maybe score in overtime and just a heave from D. Great defense by the Demons as they go on to win the big rivalry matchup 17 to 10 in an overtime victory. Unfortunately, this would make it the sixth straight loss the Northside Eagles have had to the Warner Robins Demons, but the closest loss they've had in a while, just seven points. So just a little bright side there, but that's all I've got from the Mac for you, Bill. I think Sean's got a little taste of that robbery tonight, don't you? Thanks a lot, Sean. We will have the scoreboard for you right after this. 